In Android Studio, if we generate signed bundle or APK, we can find .apk and .aab files in release and debug folders. But here, if you observe, files are created by default with the name app-debug and app-release. So every time when you want to share these builds or if you want to publish to Google Play Store or to any other third party websites, you should be changing these names to your app names manually. But anytime have you thought about having some piece of code or a way to create these builds with the app name by default? So today in this video, I will explain you how to name the APK and AAB files with your app name by default. Hello friends, welcome back to Ireka Tech Solutions. We have two solutions to set the app name to the build files. Solution 1. Changing module name. Here your project name is hello world sample, but your module name is app. So refactor the module name to your app name. Right click, select refactor and rename. Here you can see two options, rename directory, rename module. Select rename module. Now give the module name means whichever name you wanted to specify for your build files you can give the same name here. I am giving hello world and clicking on ok. So module name has updated now clean and rebuild the project and try to generate signed app bundle. Here all the details are already available because I have created the bundle, bundle file previously. Click next and select both debug and release build variants and click finish. Oh there is an error okay the destination folder does not exist okay because i changed the module name the folder name also renamed to hello world instead of app so update the destination folder path remove app and uh, change it to hello world and click finish see the aab file is created with the name hello world in both debug and release folders solution number two setting the base name in build.gradle Open modules build.gradle file. In default config, add archives base name property. Here you can specify the app name or any name you want to give to your build files. Here I am setting the name as hello world sample and also I wanted to specify the build version configurations that is version name and version code. So on every new build creation it automatically takes the build version so that you can maintain the version history for your build files. Sync the Gradle changes and rebuild the project. Now try to generate signed app bundle file. Here no changes required so click next and finish. The signed bundle generation is successful and AAB files are created under debug and release folders. See the name of AAB file it is hello world sample with version name and version code. So if you change the uh, version name, it will create an another build with updated version name. So this way you can set the name for your build file automatically. There is no need of any manual updation on every build creation. Hope you like these solutions. If you think this video was helpful for you, please like, comment and subscribe to Ireka Tech Solutions. Thank you.